Jeremy Stoll backstage at the Phantom of the Opera here. I hear you guys want to know a little bit more about what goes on backstage. So I'm going to take you backstage and ask some questions of the cast members to let you find out. The majority of my warm-up happens at home. Very gentle vocal warm-ups, which include things like... Start a physical warm up, usually rolling on this thing and uh, just doing some stretching. And I warm up my voice at like 15 before a half hour. I find I can't listen to musical theater before the show oh, yeah. because <laughs> you rolled your eyes. Yeah, yeah. For me, it just gets my mind um, uh, confused. I try to warm up before I get to the show, but uh, if it's, you know, if it's a principal, try to stretch out or something like that. Because you just never know. There's some rooms that do very fun things that I know about and I want to show you. So come with me, I'm going to show you the uh, Elizabeth and Satomi's work. Bye, Lord, when this life is over, I'll fly away <laughs> to that home Hi guys. on that celestial shore. I'll fly away. What about before the show? Do you have anything that you must do before you can go on stage? Um, if things are going well, we can't comment on it too much, or else we might jinx it. One ritual I do have is when they call five, I put a cough drop in my mouth so that it dissolves right before I have to go on stage. I, I find that I'm far more ritualistic during the show than before. Um, I have to kind of sing along with Christine at the end. <laughs> and before we go out for Prima Donna, I don't know if Christian or Pianchi shared this with you, but we always do a belly bump. Thank you for joining me today. I hope that you enjoyed hearing from the cast members. Uh, please keep the questions coming. We are at Facebook at Phantom Broadway, and we are at Twitter at Phantom B-Way. Uh, send your questions in. We'll try to answer as many as we can. And uh, as for now, I'm Jeremy Stoll, and I hope you have a great day.